In this episode of Fix It, Fix It, Fix It, we're going to discuss how to achieve the best quality render results from Adobe Premiere Pro for YouTube. The clip I show you now was rendered with the specific settings that I like to use, which I'm going to show you. Even though YouTube always re-encodes everything you give it, it's in your best interest to always give YouTube the best quality you can. This ensures that YouTube will provide you back with the best quality it can. Okay, so we have the game clip in here, and I've done all the editing, let's say, that I'm going to do to this clip. Uh, let's say it's only a minute long. Um, I'm done. I want to render this now. I want to get it out, and I want the best possible quality. So how do I achieve that? Well, I go to File, and I go to Export. Wait, file, Export. There we go. Okay, now that we're in the render settings, we're going to customize a few things. The first thing you're going to want to do is go to Format. Make sure it's on H.264. Next, go to Preset, and you're going to choose the YouTube Widescreen HD. Now, you think that that's all you would have to do, but realistically, the YouTube Widescreen HD preset is garbage. It does not produce good enough quality. It's, it's decent, but you can get better. You can give YouTube better in order to allow YouTube to give you something better. Let me show you the first things you have to change. Go down the list and you're going to have two things, profile and level. You want to make sure profile is on high and level is on 5.1. This is the highest quality um, H.264 render level. And right as soon as you did that, it changed the frame width to 1920, the frame height to 1080. But the frame rate automatically changed to 59.94 and you don't want that. You want to drop that down back to your default project settings, which is 29.97. So, right off the bat, we have 1920, 1080, 29.97, pixel aspect ratio square, profile high, level 5.1, and then we have uh, bitrate encoding. You always want to set this to VBR 2 pass. Now, <clears throat> standard television, the lowest they'll broadcast in high definition, especially a 1080, 1080 uh, file size. Um, screen resolution is like 18 to 20 megabit. They will never do lower than that, generally speaking, because the quality suffers too much. So why would you want to use something like six to nine megabit? It's it's not good. It, 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 it It's not even TV quality. And if you're doing this and you want the best of the best of the best, you want that level of quality. So we're going to bring that up. Uh, usually I like to use about 18, 18 even usually. So let's go 18, oh, not 180, <laughs> 18 and 18. This is going to produce a larger file size, but that is the cost of getting better quality. So again, 1920, 29, high, high 5.1 square pixels, VBR 2 pass, 18, 18, and generally speaking, you're fine. Uh, I would use maximum render quality with this box checked. And uh, that's for the most part, all you have to do for video settings. Now, for audio settings, you're going to want to make sure you go over to audio and make sure you're on something higher than 64 kbp kbps. Um, usually 192 gives you a nice clean sound comparable to the original. Now, that's it. I'm done. These are all the render settings you need to set. But you don't want to have to go back every single time and set these. So if you look right next to the preset custom, the first button, save preset, 1080p custom let's say YouTube okay so now whenever I want to render I'm gonna close this out and actually go back media right off the bat 1080p custom YouTube and I also have a 720p one which is the same exact settings just with the the lower frame uh, width and height nothing else has changed on this Bam. okay now I'm gonna export this out actually I don't know where I was exporting that to uh, rendering okay export and with that you're done all you have to do now is let the file convert upload to youtube and enjoy the youtube fame <laughs> and as always guys if you like what you see and you want more then do me a favor comment like and subscribe and don't forget to have a good day